The curtains are closing on a Houston institution, the River Oaks Theater, which first opened in 1939, is showing its final film tonight. Oh, man, it's hard to believe. Mm -hmm. KPRC 2's Roseanne Aragon live right outside the theater tonight. Roseanne, a lot of people feeling nostalgic over this closure. Yes, this place is filled with history. It's gorgeous within its walls, many stories all day long. People have come to take pictures with this. The River Oaks Theater, iconic historic marquee. They've lined up to get tickets, take pictures, and honor this great space that has brought so much joy for generations. It's the last day that movies will be shown at the River Oaks Theater as of now, because we don't know what the future holds. History buffs, film aficionados, and everyday neighbors lining up one last time. I came out because I'm sad that it's closing, but I wanted to catch one last show here. The unique Art Deco Neighborhood Theater opened in 1939. For 82 years, the River Oaks Theater has grown into a storytelling haven with its screenings of classic, art house, independent, and foreign language films. The look and feel of its space preserved. We don't want to lose that, you know. Movie theaters have changed over the decades, right? And they're not the same like this. This is an experience. Supporters created the coalition Friends of River Oaks Theater, hoping to save it. But the River Oaks Theater will shut its doors indefinitely after unsuccessful lease negotiations between Landmark Theaters and Weingarten Realty. The coalition is holding a vigil at 9 p.m. outside the space to honor it and remember there's a light. We as a community can, can mourn the loss of the theater and also so that we have a space to grieve and that we can also come together and be hopeful. Now that vigil will take place right here on the sidewalk at 9 o'clock. The Friends of River Oaks Theater has a Facebook group. They are hoping that something can be done to keep the spirit of this historic theater alive. For now, reporting live from River Oaks, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC, 2 News. Sad to see this day come. Oh, we hope so. I mean,